Why are you rocking back? Sneaker collection. Break. What's happening, YouTube? It's your boy Big Mike. Y'all been waiting on this, hey, to see what I had left in my sneaker collection. What I decided to keep, man, as you know, over the last year, I've gotten rid of a lot of shoes. When I say a lot of shoes, I'm talking a lot of, a lot of shoes. My daughter behind the camera. Shout out to her for doing this um, vlog of this sneaker collection for me for this video. Shout out to my baby daughter. Uh, but daddy's got rid of a lot of shoes, right? Mm -hmm. You better believe it. So look, what I kept <clears throat> is what I think I want to keep. It might be some more things I get rid of. Who knows? Because you know, as a sneakerhead, you keep copying. At one point in time, I had thought about hanging up. Yes, hanging it up. Stop being a sneakerhead. Uh, but <clears throat> I'm, I find myself still going. So I'm just going after different silhouettes. Y'all know I used to be just straight Jordan. But now today you get to see what I kept in my collection. I might even go into what my wife has. You know what I'm saying? We, we'll, we'll see. But uh, getting into it, we're going to go ahead and start with... I know y'all see all these Jordans and these nice shoes behind me. We ain't going to start there. We're going to start with the non-Jordans. Because it was uncomfortable. Okay. But anyway. <clears throat> first shoe I'm going to show you is a recent shoe. Bam! The Puma RSX. Did I say that right? RSX. And the uh, toy colorway. These are fire. Love these shoes. Very, very, very comfortable. They're not as comfortable as like your Yeezy boots or anything like that. But these things feel great on feet. In my opinion, you go through the size. The Puma RX Toys. Um, I cop, uh, cop, cop these in December. Uh, shout out to my boy, John1680. Y'all know who he is. He's on Instagram. That's my boy. Sometimes the plug. Most of all, my friend. My home. <laughs> but hey, Puma RX Toys. You hear me? Moving on, we got these, uh, hey, what's the name of these things? Hey, they Asics. They Asics. And they're dope, dope colorway. You hear me? I ain't wore these things in a while, man. I kind of call these my beaters. Because when I went to the beach, I always found myself rocking these in the beach, man, because they're the ocean colorway, right? Am I saying it right? The ocean? Beach? Ocean? Man, listen. Asics, man, in that nice emerald green colorway. I think they dope. I'm feeling them. So, uh, yeah, these things are fire. In my opinion. Let me be clean. Next we got, uh, as you know, I just got back from Orlando, Florida, Miami, Florida, uh, Fort Lauderdale, Florida, Tampa Bay. Listen, I hit up Florida. Bam! Got these Pumas, man. These Puma suede things. Uh, shout out to y'all, my subscribers, for sending this to me. Uh, you know who you are, my you know who you are, my guy. You know who you are, my guy. Mr. Red underscore King. I hope I said that right. Yeah, I think so. You know, uh, these things are fire. He gave me the red colorway. And I thought that that was it. He said, no, nah, you should have got two pairs. Turn around and got the blue colorway. And yes, things like this mean a lot to me. These will never leave the collection. So when I get stuff like this from my family, my subscribers, they stay in the box. All right. Moving on, moving on, moving on, moving on, moving on. Gotta go to these Air Max Wild Wild West things, man. Every time I see this shoe and hear that name, I think of Kumo D. But you know, I'm an OG. So, <laughs> but I am OG. So, hey, I think about that old song. You know, we Will Smith redone it with uh, uh, Cisco and everything. So, for Drew Hill, them. Hey, this shoe is fire, man. It gives out the same concept as the Levi uh, 4 in the blue denim colorway. Um, got that blue denim going all the way around. You got that uh, 3M going around a 97. Y'all know how 97s are. This is my first 97 I'm having in my collection. And by the way, I think it's a dope 97 to add to the collection. So you got the 19, 19. You got the 97 Air Max Wild Wings. Keeping the Air Max, keeping it funky. Bam! The watermelon Air Max 90s. These are fire to me, in my opinion. These are dope. I've been on the Air Max wave, man. I'm getting ready for this uh, springtime, summertime, clean time, my time. These things are fire, man. 
Got that Nike Air on the butt tocks. Yeah. Got that pinkish uh, watermelon color. Got that green. Got that touch of blue. And you got that Air Max in the royal blue on the side. Yeah. These things are straight fire, man. These are dope. And the bottom is the dopest things on these things, man. I love watermelon. I know black people love watermelon, man. Come on. So, <laughs> the Max Air Max. These are called the uh, bacon. Bacon, 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 bacon Air Max ones, man. Uh, these are only sold overseas. As far as I know, they haven't been released in the uh, U.S. yet. But they're not going for much on stock X. I think you can get them for like 140, anywhere from 140 to 150-ish range. Depends on your size. But these are dope, man. It came with the pink. Oh, it came with the uh, yellow laces that was the same color, like that ochre yellow. Um, and it came with the pink laces, man. You know I had to switch it up and put the pink laces in these bad boys. And I love that corduroy on the thing, man. It gives you that um, Sean Weatherspoon feel. So I had to have it. Different type of colors. Uh, you got that crepe bottom. Fuck! If I hit everything that's not Jordan, if I hit everything that's... No, I have it. Oh, you Yeezy fans, huh? I said, Yeezy fans, digging in there, pulling out the boom! The only Yeezy that your boy, Big Bike, like. The only Yeezy. 700. Wave Runner. Wave Runner, man. No, it's a cousin to uh, Road Runner off Looney Tunes. But he, hey, these things are fire, man. My daughter never said they look like, uh, yeah, well, they are dash. But my daughter said it looked like, um, it's like you can buy from Walmart. Uh, uh, I heard all kind of stuff. You can like you buy from Walmart. It looked like you could, it looked like uh, doctor shoes or, you know, the shoes you put on when you got one foot short of But hey, oh shout out to all the people in the world for that. These are fire Yeezy. Kanye, you did something right, man. Because I ain't like these at first, but on feet. Nice, man. Ah! These right here been with me since I started back my collection. Getting back in the YouTube thing, man. When I started my YouTube thing, these were in the collection. Bam! Sneakers and stuff box. Can y'all guess it? Can y'all guess it? Can y'all guess it? Put the box up. Bam! Rain Man things, man. Yes. Remember the Alamo Rain Man Kamikaze Twos, man. I believe that's the right name for these things. It's been a while since I wore them. But I like to wear them on Easter, man, or you know, in the springtime. That colorway is so fine still. And the only Reebok, probably the only Reebok I have in my collection, but these things are so freaking dope, man. Got like that lightest. Whew, color blue on there. The material on these things is fire. The suede, the leathers on point. A1, man. A1, man. And then they put the, the pepper in, in place for the little check through the Reebok, man. It's fire, man. Packer. Packer collab, man. Sean Kemp. Number one shoe, in my opinion. The colorway is just super fire, man. All star the San Antonio colorways. Y'all remember that? We're going to move on, though. We're going to move on. We're going to get to the Jordan. We're going to get there. We're going to get there. All right. <laughs> All right, here we go. Bam! I got almost every athlete you want. You know what I'm saying? I had some LeBron James. Bo Jackson, Bo Nose, Bo Nose, and that Pantone colorway. I think these are super fire. I had to have them. And then you got that navy blue dots inside the Pantone laces. This is how I rock them, man. I rock them with the laces loose like that. These things are fire, man. You hear me? Got that Nike on the back, embroidered right there. That Nike print. Nice suede on them. Got the white bottom, you see I wear these things. Hey, wear your shoes, people. Wear your shoes. Clean your shoes too, though. This is a bad example. You need to clean your shoes. <laughs> clean your shoes. But hey, these are fire. Summertime ready, man. Summertime ready. Bojack. Also, here's another shoe I didn't throw in. Uh, the bona fide Nike joints. These I keep for my exercising shoe, man. Bought these joints for like $48 to $50. Got the zipper in the back and the zips up. Uh, got the zip up action going on. 
uh, something like a zip up action on the fair guys, but that one is much more luxury. So yeah, gotta throw these in there. The bonafide joints. Got the Jason Key and old school bottoms on them. My kid called these uh, alien eyes. They'd be like, you got them alien eyes on? Alien eyes, man. But to me, they are a fresh pair on feet, man. And believe it or not, I get a lot of compliments when I wear this shoe, man. When I wear this sneaker, I get a lot of compliments, man. Bonafide Nikes. This is what you've been waiting on. We're gonna give you what you want. We're gonna start with the Jordan 1s. All right, we're gonna start with the Jordan 1s. Do I have the low, lows in here, right? My low Jordan 1s? In the closet. In my closet or in the other closet? Okay, I got the, I'm just gonna tell you like this. I got the Air Jordan Low with a couple of lows. I don't know what I got here, man, what I got. Got another closet in there. It's got shoes in it. Y'all gotta forgive me. Y'all just gonna see this part of the collection, all right, that I usually go to. Um, or that you normally see when I'm in the video, okay? But I do have the Air Jordan Chicago Lows. That's like my kick around shoe, which is why it's not in this room. I like to put them on and go to Walmart. I beat those things to the ground. YouTube, look, I wanted to throw this in here real quick, man. Just to show you these beaters. There's the Jordan 1 Low Chicago's. How many of y'all remember when I copped these things, man? Much cleaner when you cop them. I might get another pair of these lows, man. These were dope. Um, I just, I beat them to the ground, man. You see how beat up they are? That's, the uh, colors on is changing. I swear to y'all, I do everything in these, man. I mow the yard, <laughs> I go to Walmart, quick run to the grocery store, any Chicago lows, man. So just wanted to throw that in there. I know I was saying that I didn't, uh, that was in the closet. So I went ahead and stopped the vid, did it the right way, went to the closet, pulled them out. Cause that's what they made for, to look good. Jordan one Chicago lows. With that being said, let's get into it, all right? So, first shoe. Gotta go with the bread things, man. Bread action for you. Jordan 1 bread. Mm. Mm. Heat, straight out the bat. Heat for you. Red and black. If you're, hey, you're a sneaker fan, you gotta have these in your collection. No doubt about it. Gotta have them. I'm excited because I love Jordan 1s. So you know I was anxious to get to this moment. Jordan 1 bread. What's the thing about them, baby? You dig them? They fire? You better believe it. That's my daughter talking like that. Bam! Royal ones. This shoe was, uh, I mean, the bread one spoke for itself. That's why I was so hyped. Y'all know the bread ones spoke for itself, but the royal ones, clean colorway. Some people downplay this shoe, man. But the, but the quality on these Jordans that's coming out lately, the quality. Five. Dope. And then you got that Nike on the tongue, man. I love OG official, OG colorways. I love the, uh, uh, the regular leather that they're using, like the 2019 leather they're using on shoes. I haven't bought a pair of Jordans in 2019, fellas. No. And I really, really, really wanted the, um, what do they call the green one? The one, uh, Turbo Greens. Really, really wanted them. See them in hand? Still got a chance to go get them from the plug, man. Um, I don't know, man. It's a different type of way, but that, that side panel, that, that leather, it ain't this, people. It ain't this. All right, moving on. Black toe ones, boom. Classic, you know I say more. Got lucky and hit these off of the, when they released, got them for retail. Hit them off of the uh, Foot Locker app. And I was just like this, not thinking I'm gonna hit, like, come on, please, you gonna let me in. He's gonna let, and when it got in, I was like, I knew I was gonna hit. <laughs> yeah, black toe one, baby. Black toe ones, got that Nike on the tongue. You know what I'm saying? They got some mid colorway Jordan ones coming out with some clean, clean fire colorway. But if it ain't that Nike in the tongue, I can't rock switch. I can't fuck switch. Moving on. The exclusive over the seas look. The best out of that uh, four shoes they released. That was what, the best out of game pack or something like that with the cars and all that. Yeah, yada, yada. This was the colorway everybody should get. This is the main one. This is the only one I was feeling. That yellow okra one fire. Um, on the SC's things the other day, man. Shout out to my people that love me on IG. Y'all go follow me on IG. Make sure y'all like, share, comment, subscribe. Also, and if you ain't subscribed, what you waiting on? We in here doing it big with these Jordan 1s, baby. Jordan 1, yellow, okra. These things are fire. 
If you don't have them, there's other Jordan ones you can cop. But me, had to have them. Had to have them. All right, moving on. Um, Blue Storm ones. Blue Storm ones? Yeah, Blue Storm ones. Storm uh, Blue. Storm Blue ones. Storm Blue ones. I'm sorry. Blue Storm. Storm Blue, Blue Storm. They're blue and the storm and the storm and blue. But anyway, hey, look. It's old. Hey, look. <laughs> For real, people are uh, downgrading this shoe when they first came out. I love this shoe. Love Jordan ones, period. My wife surprised me with this shoe for my birthday when they released, I believe it was 2016? 17. One of those. 16. Right after Christmas, I remember it. You know, so these things are just fire, man. I love them. Uh, my daughter loved them so much, she begged me for a prayer, so I got her a prayer. She loves these shoes. Kentucky colorway, baby. And you since we rocking with uh, the Kentucky, Tennessee. I say Kentucky, Tennessee because we right there on the border, baby. Straight down the border, which is crazy. But, hey, these things are fire, man. It's a go. These ones that I'm showing you right now today is a go. All right, moving on. Letterman ones, baby. You can go get these for, what, probably about 75 bucks. You find the right person right now. So these things just, to me, fire. Look at the quality, y'all. I rocked the hell out of these things. See how wrinkled that toe is? Look at that. Wrinkle. Wrinkle. Rock them, baby. Rock your shoes, man. Look. Wear your shoes, man. Fire, man. These lettermans are nice. Got that nice navy metallic metallic uh, material around the collar of the shoe. And got the metallic swoosh on these things, man. These were dedicated to uh, Jordan being on the Letterman show and that ugly-ass suit he had on. Jordan, you my dog. You the goat. That was an ugly-ass suit. So, moving on. <laughs> <laughs> got my only custom ones. Um, in that pink colorway. Now, I told him when he done the custom. You remember my video, you can go back. I told him when he done my damn custom to get as close as he can to those uh, Art Basil ones. But, of course, these are a little off. They're more like a bubblegum pink. But these things are still fucking dope. I'll rock these today and people be like, man, them things are fire. We got the black toe pink ones. That's right, I gave them a name. Black toe pink ones. These are fire, man. Dope. Pink all around the bottom. You know what I'm saying? You can tell that customer starting to chip around here. So if y'all actually wondered about that, it's been about, what, a year almost since I had them? So I wore them, rocked them, man. So this, it's holding up pretty good, man. That pink. That pink. And you know, got that Nike on the tongue. So shout out to the custom dude that got this, gave this custom. Um, yeah, I can't give him the name because he tried to mess up with my boy, man. Don't know what happened. He tried to mess up with my boy, man. So we're going to move on. So that'll probably be the last custom I had on him. UNC ones, man. Such a dope colorway. Dope classic. Uh, everybody was not feeling this shoe when it came out. Of course, your boy was, you know, because I rock with ones like that. But they wasn't feeling this shoe. But they're feeling it now because of the off-white UNC one that came out. And with people who didn't want to afford them. So let's start going to get these UNC ones. Uh, shout out to my boy Gone AWOL. We had a conversation about this not too long ago. And uh, since they start going to get these, the price don't shot up on these. So hey, I appreciate it, y'all. I appreciate it because they ever go bad, I'm going to cop another pair. I don't give a damn what the price is. UNC ones, baby. All day, every day. This colorway rocks. Love the OG colorways, man. Love them. Moving on to one of my favorite Jordan ones. My favorite color. Orange, you hear me? These things are just fire. The reverse shattered backboards, the 2.0s, uh, 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 the uh, always, uh, these things are fire, but the quality is sick. And this is what I'm talking about. This is the leather that I want, Jordan. Jordan, bring I know you ain't gonna hear me because I'm way down here in Lonely, Tennessee. But then check it out. I need this. I need this kind of quality in my life. I'm waiting on that next uh, Shattered Backboard to release, I think, in November, October, November, for the Halloween like, Hey, that orange, man. It do it, man. It do it. All right, moving on. Whew. The Lady Maze. Need I say more? She got a nice Fire 6 that just released, y'all, but this right here, these are just fire, man. I had to have them. I had to have them by any means necessary. When they said I was only releasing in LA in uh, I think Chicago, and I think Dam D done a video not too long well when he when they released and he won like a raffle ticket or something in Houston. So it wasn't too many places that got these. There's not a lot of people that has these. Um you're able to get them on stock guess if you're gonna pay that money, but it is not a lot of pairs of these out there. I do know that. 
So if you if it was in my best interest to tell you, they dust collectors. They lint collectors. They lint collectors. My daughter called them. She, what'd you say they were, man? Dust collectors. Dust collectors. Because of that what? What's the material? Carpet. <laughs> she called them carpet. Just, just, just disrespect. Hey, Elena May. Appreciate you. So, uh, moving on. These come in a pack. Well, that was a, it was a pack, but you know they sold them individually. Jordan know how to get that money. These uh, Ying, Yang, Ying and a Yang pack, and this is the black colorway. Um, done a little something special with my laces right there. These are five. Uh, the wifey said she wanted to do a mix and match, and it was like a Ying and a Yang, you know. So let me go ahead and show the white pair that uh, came with it. There's the white pair. To me, they're just fire, man. You got the red on both tongues. Fire pack, man. You don't get one, you gotta get both. Gotta get both. Gotta get both. All right. So moving on. Uh, where am I? Where am I? Where am I? Shadows. Got the shadow Jordan ones, man. I'm trying to go as fast as I can, y'all, but I gotta talk about them because I just love sneakers. That's what we're here for. The culture, baby. The culture. Shadow ones. Uh, was glad these finally released. It was like the last OG colorway that I wanted to cop. Almost, almost. Uh, in my color in uh in the collection, and these shadow ones are fire. You can wear these with anything. A lot of people are putting them with almost. I mean, damn near almost anything. It's gray and black, man. Gotta love them. Shadow ones. You like these? Fire. So, all right, moving on. Got these all black. These came in a pack too with the um um. All the all sell uh, colorway Jordan ones, but these are all black premiums. They're more of a uh, matte black finish, and these are just fire, man. They remind me of like if you remember the old school, uh, uh, <laughs> the old school uh, car shows or the shows that used to come on. It remind me of Night Rider, man. I just love how it's all black and got that red Night Rider had the little rig. I don't know. That's an OG joke. That's an OG. If you remember that, these things are fire, man. Love them. Love them. Moving on. Dope colorway, dope shoe. Love the laces from the laces, the lace tips, all the way uh, to the shoe itself, man. These are fire, the all-star ones. Um, when they first released, I thought like the resale value would be sky high on these. Um, so when they first released, everybody was um, <clears throat> going after them, but the, but the resale value wouldn't be that much. You know, for the first month, they were hot. After that, they, it wasn't hot. Now the uh, resale volume shoot, shooting back up. So resale for the Jordan ones is an iffy thing, but usually they go up skyrocket. Skyrocket. So the Jordan ones. <laughs> tell I'm tired. I just got to work out. So look, Jordan ones, all stars, dope colorway. Whew, dope colorway. All right. Um, uh, that it for that side. Mm -hmm. All right, moving on to the middle. There's more, fellas. There's more. Uh, top three ones, man. Top three ones. Shout out to my boy Pop Pop. Uh, did a trade for me. With me. Uh, on some shoes I no longer have, of course. Um, I won't I won't reveal the shoe. Doesn't matter if anybody won the trade or not. But <clears throat> he definitely helped me out because he had two parodies. So it wasn't about winning a trade. It was just about the culture of things. And that's what's leaving, man. The culture of helping people out get shoes that they that they want. He wanted that pair, I wanted this pair. Had to have these in the collection. Still dead stock. Haven't worn yet, but I did lace them. Uh, these are fire, man. You know, the other shoe looks totally different. Um, I think it's the Chicago, the Breads, and the Royals, right? I think. Or the Black Toes and the Royals. One of the two. But uh, those three shoes in it, fire, man. You got one red sole, one blue sole. Just a dope, dope, dope shoe. Uh, ready to wear them, bust them out this summer. Probably for the 4th of July. So, moving on. Got a nice, nice shoe. Great story to this shoe. Can y'all believe? Y'all know this is the Pinnacle, Pinnacle Gold 1. Uh, $400 retail shoe. Uh, I think they're going for like $500 right now. $500 to $600. Um, you might be able to get somebody to give you a used pair for like $250 to $300. If you're lucky. Um, I wore these a couple times. Uh, my, me and my wife's anniversary last year. These are fire, man. I love these. Uh, the colorway is very, very similar to the OVO 12s. If you have those, the colorway is very, very similar. Uh, has that stingray all around the shoe. Got that 24 karat plated. 
gold plate, and that plate on that Nike Air and a ton, boy. Woo! Ashley paid. $54. Shout out to the plug for these. If you're looking for me, I mean, if you're looking at the video, you know who you are. Um, my foot action plug, man. Won't reveal, but my foot action plug. You know who you are, brother. But anyways, going on to the next one. Got these gold toes, man. Woo! These. These, me and my boy Rob, man, we was like, hey, man. We need those top three gold things that released in Complex. I was miserable. Hot about it. Because I wasn't about to pay no fucking plane tickets to get out there to the Complex and be empty-handed. Because I know a lot of people went out there and didn't get them. But these, we seen these were releasing. So I didn't have to pay that seven to a, $700 to $1,000 for them joints. Went ahead and waited for these gold toes. Shout out to my plug that looked out for me. We even reached out and got my boy John a pair. Man, these are just fire, man. And these I'm still going to double up on. I got to double up. What do you think, baby? I got to double up? Double up. Got to have it. All right, here we go. <sighs> here we go, here we go, here we go. I'm moving on. I got to go faster. Got to go faster. My daughter getting tired back there. Metallic red ones, all right? Metallic red ones. No colorway. Clean. Classic. Metallic red ones. See if I can remember the names of all these shoes. Uh, <laughs> these are the... Oh, God. What are these? These are low budget uh, shoes. My sneaker of the year for the low, as far as uh, being slept on. My number one slept on shoe for 2018. These are the, um, God, not Glacier. Guava. Guava Ice. Guava Ice ones. Dope colorway, man. Dope colorway. Can't wait to break these out for the spring. You got the Father's Day, uh, what are these called? Family Forever. Father's Day uh, ones. The denim ones. Uh, the kids made these uh, for Jordan for his fa for Father's Day. Fireman got the blue, red, yellow. Came with all those lace colors. Fireman, dope shoe. Um, I had to keep one Gatorade. Gatorade Jordan ones. You see, I wore my shoes. The Gatorade orange peel uh, Jordan ones. Love that Gatorade lightning bolt on the side. That's fire. <coughs> um, had to bust them out. I ain't warm yet. Dead stop. Got those, uh, what is, what is, what is, what is, what is. Oh, God, Jesus. Y'all know Pine. I know my water. Pine green Jordan ones. Y'all, it's funny because she was trying to guess the shoes about her collection. And she got this one right. Ain't that something? Pine green Jordan ones, man. Dope. Ah, these came right out the same day. Did you know I, I got these early from uh, from uh, Kick Square? Shout out to Kick Square. Uh, these are the purple uh, Jordan ones. The purple. These are fire, man. A lot of these. This was number one on a lot of people's uh, uh, shoe of the top year. <clears throat> number one shoe of the year in 2018. These are these are hard. These are these are fire. All right. <clears throat> I think we almost done with the Jordan ones, right? Mm -hmm. Woo! So we got the Vachetta ones, man. Should have brought some water here. Got the Vachetta ones. Uh, these are fire. This is a $400 pinnacle as well. Another pinnacle. Yes, I love my pinnacles. If you don't know that, you will get to know me. I love my pinnacles. And as far as that, I love my pinnacle ones. I got two more colors in the pinnacle ones to collect. But as far as the two I really, really wanted, I got them. These are dope, man. And another thing, when you grow old, these grow old. The leather cheek keeps turning colors when they grow older. Love them. Vachetta ones. Okay. Now. Oh, one more Jordan one. <laughs> you got the homage to home ones, man. Homage to home. A lot of people love the tongue on it because it stays high. It's like hard. I don't know what they did with the tongue, but it's like a scar face tongue. Well, with the way it goes down the middle. And you got the bread on one side. And you got the Chicago on the other side, man. Can't go wrong. And if you love, if you're a Jordan one fan, you got to have these. Got to pay homage. You got to pay homage for the top two colorways in the Jordan 1s. Okay. That does it for my Jordan 1s. That completes my Jordan 1s that I decided to keep. Okay. I don't know how many it was. I'm not counting. I know it was probably a good, good amount. I didn't show this a while ago and I was supposed to. Got the Fear of Gods. The reason I wasn't trying to show it because I talk about this shoe a lot. This is my shoe of the year for 2019. I'll go ahead and just say it. Shoe of the year for me, in my opinion, and for a lot of other people also. 
and the best colorway of the Fear of God, in my opinion, also. Um, these are fire. Can't wait to wear them. These shoes are actually heavy, and they run just a tad big, but, but for some people say, but for me, they run great, true to size, in my opinion. But um, I got wifey. So, these are the fire. Fear of Gods. If you haven't seen them, Fear of Gods. Okay? Okay. Putting them back in. Okay. What was I at? Twos. Going to the twos. Going to the twos. The twos. This is a long video, y'all. No. These are my babies. Blueberry Yum Yums. Got those just done twos, man. That blue colorway, the original colorway. These are, I used to call these a thousand dollar smile. Let's see. <laughs> Love them. Love them. Love them. My babies. Okay. Putting those up. That's the only Jordan 2 that I own. And I keep that right up here in the box, man. Because I like to look at these things. You know what I'm saying? So I keep them right up here in the box beside the Chicago Bear. <laughs> in my Mike Singletary football. Um, all right, threes got the Kai 54 threes overseas release. Um, got a white insole, these things, and it came with that clear Jordan 3 tag. Man, a clear Jordan 3 tag. The Kai 54 threes, these colors pop. I wore these in uh, Florida, everybody was looking down at my feet. Surprisingly, no, not a lot of people didn't have them on, I guess, because I didn't see nobody with them on. So these are overseas release. I love wearing shoes that a lot of people don't have, which is why everybody's staring towards the more limited or more um, overseas releases. Everybody's getting tired of the GRs. Not saying they ain't dope, just getting tired of the GR. Kyle 54 threes. Moving on to the next three. I think the last three I own, it is. It's the um, Katrina threes, man. The Katrina threes. I did not cop the black cements. I might go back and get those. Just wasn't on the hype wave of the black cements, man. Threes are not my favorite, but this red and white colorway just does it for me, man. These things are fire. To me, this is to me, this is the best silhouette. I mean, not best silhouette, the best colorway of the silhouette. Uh, the Katrina threes, really, the white cements are my favorite of the three. But this is the closest thing I can get to it, other than those Timberlands, and I ain't want to pay that high dollar for uh, for those. But these Katrina threes. Are doing me great justice. Fire. I rocked them one time. Can't wait till the summertime to rock them again. Katrina threes. We'll get the royalty fours. A lot of people didn't like this shoe when it released. Um, to me, it's still a dope colorway. Everybody used to be. You know what's funny? This shoe started the ashiness of the suede, if you will. But suede is not real, people, unless it shows some type of ash. It shows you how good the suede is on these. I mean, these shoes were hyped up at one moment. They let down when they release. I think they are dope colorway. I think they are fire. Love the suede on them. That's why I kept them in the collection. A lot of people didn't keep them in the collection. Kept them in the collection because I think this is going to be a shoe that people go back for. Royalty fours. All right, moving on. As y'all see, I got a lot of black and gold, but I do have a lot of different colors in my collection. My favorite four ever. Ever. Favorite four. These ginger things, man. Shout out to Unbreakable Kicks. Uh, they had them up there in the outlet up there, I think, off 83rd. Is 83rd Unbreakable or 87th? Correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, the outlet off the, uh, up there in Chicago. I, I had been recently up there, but I had came home. And then, boom, they hit these in the outlet right when I left Chicago. Hit Unbreakable up. He did not hesitate. Cop these things for your boy for a great price. Just charged me the shipping. Sent them to me. Hey, forever grateful to you for that unbreakable. You know these are my favorite pair. Ginger Fours, man. Whew. These things are fire. Beautiful. Love these shoes, man. Love them. Had the uh, 2014 infrareds. Um, these are dead stop because I just sold my 2014 pair. Had to go ahead and get the Nike on the ass for the infrared 6. My favorite colorway in a 6, period. My favorite 6, hands down. Uh, nothing beats this six, in my opinion. Uh, these just pop when you walk anywhere. I don't care where you go. Somebody's going to say, those shoes are dope. So the infrared six went with a darker red. Everybody's feeling them. Might be the shoe of the year for some people. Infrared six, y'all. Maroon sixes. <laughs> Woo! These are up there. These are up there at the top of the line for the sixes, man. Got that Nike air on the ass right there. 
That Nike Air does it for some people. Got that off-white cream vibe to it. That maroon colorway. I, wear, I like to wear mine down here. Uh, some, you hear lately, I haven't. I just switch it up, y'all. Switch it up. I ain't wore these in a while. They need to be clean. Shows you I rock them. Look at there. I rock my shoes, people. They need to be clean. But uh, fire. Fire dope colorway. A recent pickup of the Chinese New Year's Sixes. I passed on these when they first came by. I love to see people rock their shoes and then wear them out. And I'll go back and get them, you know what I'm saying? Because I know a lot of people won't rock these or scared to rock these. Don't Never be scared to rock something. Believe in yourself. You know who you are. You know what you are. Rock your damn shoes. These are fire. Had to go back and get them. Chinese. Love the rose, man. Love the rose. Great job. Moving on. It's more Jordan 6s. Gatorade 6s, man. Not the regular colorway Gatorade photo. Uh, reaching to my wife collection real quick. The regular uh, Jordan Gatorade 6s are that color. But you know I had to get these green things, man. So these green things. Look how small this shoe is. cute. These green things, man. Uh, fire. Had to have them. I remember that video I done. That's one of my, today, my, one of my greatest videos. Everybody loved that video. I was, I went crazy. Boy, I went wild for these things. Go check that video out if you ain't watched it. Gatorade Green Sixes, man. The Grinch things. So, moving on. Got the Pinnacle Gold Sixes, man. Fire, fire, fire. Thought about selling these. Every time I get to a point to where I'm going to sell them, I pull them out, and then that light hits it. I can't do it, man. Just like I'm telling you right now, I can't do it, man. I can't do it. Fire, fire. By the way, the package on that Gold Sixes is just off the chain. <clears throat> got these uh remember what's the name? UNC sixes. UNC sixes. Got that black suede, just like the infrareds, man. Just like the infrareds. Can't go wrong, man. UNC sixes, just a dope colorway. Only thing they didn't give you is the 3M, but it's not an OG shoe. But they did give you the colorway. Be happy. Be happy, sneakerhead. Ugh. Picking up this old pinnacle six. Ah, what is it called? The, the Take Flight uh, Pinnacle Sixes? Satin. Uh, got the satin. Yeah, all green satin on these things, man. I see a lot of people got rid of them talking about they can't do it. I can do it. The boy like rocking different shoes, man. Different colorways. And this six right here does it, man. I wore these things, man, um, early fall. And I'm telling you, when that sunlight hit them, <laughs> does it hit them. So... <clears throat> Getting to the sevens. You got the Jordan uh, hair sevens, man. Jordan hair sevens. My favorite seven, hands down, man. Favorite colorway of a seven, period. Bugs Bunny, I loved Looney Tunes when I was young. And when they put Jordan and Bugs Bunny together, it's over with. Put my favorite basketball player and my favorite Looney Tunes character, Bugs Bunny. Fire. Okay. <clears throat> Another seven, the last seven, I believe. Yeah, I got the two dopest and uh, two classic colorways of a seven, in my opinion. The Bordeaux seven, I rock these, man. You see the creases in there? I rock these. Love the colorway. These are fire, man. Dope colorway. Love the designs on the tongue, what the sevens are known for. Dope. Only seven I'm missing is the Olympic seven. I'm coming for you, Olympic. I'm coming for you. Olympic sevens. All right. Moving to the eight. Moving over here to the eights of what I decided to keep. Again, this remind, keep this in, keep in mind, this is what I decided to keep, what I saw. You got the trophy eights. Some people call them the championship eights. Some people call them the champagne eights. Whatever the fuck eights. White and gold, right here, clean. Dope. And inside the strap you got world champions. And again, and again, man. Fire, dope shoe, level. Um, you got that nice hang tag right there. Uh, official certificate of celebration gear. Just dope, man. You got Michael Jordan's fingerprints on the side of the shoe and on the bottom of the shoe, man. There go. Go dust. Look, cool. Eight. Um, got welcome in the back of the tongue. You got that OVO owl on the back heel right there. And these are just a fire colorway. I didn't cop the white. I decided to keep the black. These are fire. I got rid of my OVO 10s, y'all. It's a lot of stuff I got rid of. OVO 10s had to go. Kept the 8s. I thought the 8s looked better. 
Nice leather. Just as good as quality as the tin. So, my daughter got tired, y'all, so I'm gonna have to do the video and continue it like this. Um, I just talked about these. The Jordan 9, the Tax 9s. You know what I'm saying? Clean, dope, dope shoe. These are one of the ones I decided to keep. Just a shoe you can throw on when it's wet, rainy, or do you want to be clean? Cause they are a clean, dope shoe. You know what I'm saying? The Concours. Okay. These are fire. Um, cop two pair of these. Got to have two pair. Sorry, but you got to have them. Other pair is over there in the closet. Um, I got more shoes, y'all, in the closet. Um, or up here in boxes like these that I do not feel like taking out of these boxes. I'm so sorry. This video has been long enough, man. So I got two pair of these things. And if you haven't seen the on feet vid where I did on these just the other day, uh, go check the video out, man. Dope video, getting some dope um, remarks about the video. Dope quality action on that video, man. That video, that fit was nice. Y'all comment down below what you thought of that video. If you did watch it, uh, shout out to y'all for watching these videos. Um, you got these um, alternate 12 things, man. These things are dope. Uh, I do wear my shoes, though. I do wear my shoes. Check them out. White bottoms dirty. It don't matter. I decided to keep these just because of the colorway, man. I, my favorite 12 is the cherry 12s, and until they come out, these will have to do, man, with their red and white um, colorway scheme. Okay? Alternate 12s. Um... Bordo 12s, just wore these the other day. Also, if you, if you follow me on Instagram, you've seen the pictures I post of my fits. I uh, love posting those fits pics, man. Uh, these are just fire. I feel like this is a colorway that everybody's going to be sought out there later on in years, later on in life. So I had to keep these in the collection, man. Keeping them around, I had to clean them up. Wore them one time, and look how those bottoms do, man. But glad they made these like a sail bottom instead of a white. So might not clean up badly. Bordo 12s, man. Okay, what else? What else? What else? Moving on. Um, <clears throat> moving on to my favorite and only pair of 13s I kept. I had the lows in these as well. So those um, CP3. So those. Um, thought about copping the royal white and blue pair of 13s. I still might do that actually. These are fire. Um, thought about copping those mellows because they're cheap, but. If I'm not going to wear them, I ain't going to cop them. So I might cop the Mellows. I might cop the White and Blue Royal 13s of these also. But these are by far my favorite, favorite 13, man. Only wore them one time. Don't even want to wear them a lot. Love them. Cherish this shoe a lot. Cherry 13s, man. That cherry colorway when Jordan was rocking on the court, man. I love that cherry scheme. And that's just why I like that white and red so much, man. So these are fire. <clears throat> Moving on. Did you see I had no fives in my collection, man. I had no uh, tens um, in my collection. Uh, just, you know, very few things, man. But a lot of things I got rid of. Here's the 18s, man. These are just a fire-ass shoe. Um, reminded me a lot of the, the all-red fives I had. I sold those as well. Um, these are fire, man. Just a fire, fire silhouette. Dope shoe. Looks great on feet. Uh, just dope. <laughs> Just dope, man. Nice. 18s. I call them them Lamborghini things. Lamborghini 18s, and you got the Ferrari 14s, you know. So I like to go with Lamborghini on those. Um, like I said, I like to keep different shoes. So I kept these around. A lot of people don't like these, but I love them. The 23 Chicago's, man. The Shy Cities. Got their area code in the back of that thing. I think a different one than the other one. I'm not sure. I think it is. Let me see. Anyway, it says Shy on that shoe. On this shoe, it says City, with the picture of Chicago City. You got the markings of the flag, Chicago flag, and it does say 312 behind that time. And you, of course, you know the 23 silhouettes got Jordan's um, signature and um, his uh, footprint on the bottom of it. So this is just a dope shoe. Great quality on the shoe also. Look at that leather. So I keep shoes that people ain't going to really rock, man. So... That's gonna do it, man. Uh, I think it's gonna do it. I hope y'all enjoyed it, man. Um, I wanted to bring it to you. It's been a while, been a, been a long time coming to bring you this um, collection video. So just wanted to show you what I kind of held on to with some shoes I didn't show y'all, but um, well, hold on. You know, I'll, also I'll show you these. 
So like these up here, I'll show you these. Y'all know what this is. There's some heat. So your boy got some heat that I left out. It's just hard to get to everything, y'all, because this video is long as hell right now. You know it? These are something I cherish, cherish too. These are my second best fours, just so you know. The room's junky. Um, look at there. Them white junks, man. Them things. That's them. That's them. Them white Levi's, man. Woo. These things are so, so beautiful. So beautiful. Don't know when I'm going to wear them, man. So beautiful. Look at there. That bottom does it all, doesn't it? Just does justice with that gum and white and red. <whistles> Jordan, no, you did a thing with these, man. You know it. So, put these things up, man. Uh, put these things up. Like I said. <laughs> Certain shoes I keep up on top of my thing, man, because, you know, I don't take them out the box, y'all. I don't take those out the box. They're not ready yet. Space Jams, you know what I'm saying? Y'all know what they look like. Those are my twos I showed you earlier, just done. Um, I got some more in my closet over here. Uh, you see Jordan up here. You see it. My kids made this for me for Father's Day, y'all. You see that, man. Got his rival, Jordan and Ewan, you know what I'm saying? You know. You know, I keep stuff that my kids make over the years. You know, they're they're up, they're grown now, but this is what they made me over the years, so I keep it. You know what I'm saying? Um, hat collection. You know, I can do one of those. But look, more hats, more hats. But look, y'all, it's just, you know what I'm saying? I wanted to give it to you. I've been promising you a collection video. I'm actually disappointed that I gave you a collection video now because it would have been a lot more shoes to go over, but that video probably would have been hours long if I kept all those shoes and what's the reason of keeping those shoes when you're not gonna rock them man so I hope you enjoyed with that being said I hope you enjoyed the video it's your boy Big Mike stay tuned for more vids to come thank y'all for rocking with your boy for those who haven't subscribed yet what you waiting on we, you see what I'm rocking with man I keep the real shoes that I'm gonna actually keep in my collection and if it's a shoe that I forgot to mention y'all um, I'm trying to think is anything I didn't mention man it's in that closet it's actually couple more prayers. I know it's a pinnacle. Um, let me grab my wife pair. This right here. My wife pair. These French blues, I got these. We actually, me and my wife actually bought these together. Um, you know, you know, or when you're a husband or wife, you know those days you want to dress like she wanted to get these just like me. Um, it's actually a couple pairs of shoes we've done the same. So I got these in the closet. I don't feel like putting them out, so I just show you her pair. Um, yeah, man, that's that's basically it, y'all. That's it, man. So, like, share, comment, subscribe. Thank you for rocking with me. Till next time, yeah.